everyone I hope you're looking forward to Christmas and it seems a good idea to work out some designs for Christmas cards that are going to be really quick and easy to paint now I use these cards which you just fold in half they come with an envelope and I actually paint onto this cardy paper and um, see it's got a deckled edge but what I like to do is I will fold that over and so it's very random I can get quite a lot of cards out of that I just rip that paper and then I will fold that again and again and you can see you've got these perfect size pieces to fit onto your card so that will fit on like that and um, that's just perfect so shall we begin with the painting here are my cheeky little robins and i'm gonna keep this again very simple it's a different view he's looking at the other one that we did so i think that's quite nice that there's one looking in and we'll, no we can make these really interesting now i'm just going to use some cadmium red just sort of washed out at the top bring that down take that over his beak that's what comes out there uh, there's a little bit of whitey grey and I'm going to go for that intense violet Just let that bleed in and then very quickly I'm going to use some rich sepia I love this colour let that bleed in a little bit there and as simple as that I'm just going to catch those bleeds so that we can keep that quite light and grey I'm going to use my tiny little brush and I'm going to mix some thick rich sepia and some Prussian blue together so nice and dark there's not a lot of water on there and then we'll put that cheeky little beak in and so it comes in quite a way and then the eye so do a nice big eye and we'll get some white onto that in a while and these, I just love their sort of sticky little funny legs. And that comes over. Oh, we're going to give him a branch because that's just more Christmassy. And that little leg comes from back there. And then I can put the dark bit underneath whilst I've got that on my brush. And um, I think I have a snowy branch because it's Christmas. I love these rake brushes they've got uneven ends and we can get quite a lot of texture very quickly onto our picture so using some rich sepia quite thick I'm just going to make that feather shape here and we can sort of twist that around and give a nice flighty tail It sort of does it for you and I'm going to have a little bit of texture here and I'm going to have a bit of a feather sort of showing here again to add movement to our picture a little tiny robin feather a little bit of texture on his head and that is just so so easy and then I'm going to go for the smaller brush which I'm going to put some alizarine crimson on so the same sort of rake brush it's dark underneath that beak so you get the shape of that head so it's a little bit of a twist there and then the body comes out and I think maybe a bit of dark there just above all the texture maybe just, just makes it a bit more interesting
let's clean that little brush well and we'll have a little bit of mauve coming through here for our snow and the other thing I'm going to do is because he's ruffling his feathers and it matched the other cards that we've done with a little bit of the cadmium red we can have some feathers flying off maybe another one here where he's ruffling those feathers and he looks like he's been up to something and he's sort of saying hmm not me and I'm going to get some of the blue the Prussian blue with the sepia and we're going to do little dots of snow so that we're going to have a series of these robins tiny little dots just some touching the ends so they're random they're not all the same size we put some onto that using some of my white gouache just get it as thick as you can on that little tiny brush and then we're going to make his eye quite interesting so sort of run that through the middle and then we give it a little bit of sparkle and I think we get a bit of shape of the wing into and some snow on him so some big and some little and the white then shows up on the dark and I'm just going to tidy up that beak a little bit with some white Yeah, he looks cheeky and he don't really does look like he's saying, what, me? And I'm just having a look at it and I think it could do with a little bit more fluffiness. So with a bit more of the red, just make it a, a little bit more lively. And maybe we could just pull that out. Yeah, that just makes him look like he's fluffing his feathers a little bit more. A little bit more cheeky. Finally we're going to put our robin onto our card and I'm going to put it this way um, because it's quite nice to have them different when you're doing a series. So with our copy decks I've just got an applicator it's so easy to do and all I'm going to do is put some paste along the top and the bottom And we then press that onto our card. And against this brown paper, I think those lovely broken edges look superb. I just press that hard. And then with an elegant writer, I'm just going to put them there. Happy Christmas in your best handwriting. I really hope that you've enjoyed watching me create this little cheeky chap um, in part of our series and you can paint them just in minutes and you can maybe paint 10, 20 at a time and just speed it up, do one little section at a time. So have a happy Christmas. We'll